Most of us know that Barry Tibbetts worked for the town of Kennebunk for 24 years, the last 18 years as our town manager. During his tenure, the town grew both in size and complexity. This change from a quiet New England seacoast town to a more vibrant community required a steady hand at the helm. Under Barry's leadership, numerous restorative and visionary projects were undertaken and completed, including conversion of the old post office to the police department headquarters, restoration of Gooch's and Middle Beach seawalls, creation of access roads between the post office and retail establishments, construction of the West Kennebunk Fire Station, purchase and sale of Cousins and Park Street schools for affordable housing, implementation of a recycling program, renovation of the Dorothy Stevens Center and the Town Hall Auditorium, creation of TIF districts to leverage tax dollars for the infrastructure projects, including the renewal of the Pythian Block Building, achievement of a AAA bond rating from Standard & Poor's, but the crowning achievement of Barry's career was the restoration of the downtown area and the construction of the Waterhouse Center. However, most of us don't know a lot about the Barry Tibbets we don't see in public. Barry was born in Dania, Florida on January 8, 1956 to Phil and Mona Tibbets. His family hopscotched around the country as his father was promoted and spent time in South Dakota, Long Island, and upstate New York before settling in Scarborough. Perhaps foreshadowing his future profession, he worked as a carny on the boardwalk in Old Orchard Beach. He continued his hardworking ways with three jobs to put himself through college. His young adulthood was marked by a vagabond lust to see the world. He hitchhiked throughout the United States, working for a time as a roustabout on an oil rig. He then traveled to China and took a job as a bartender. When he and his brother hijacked a Chinese military motorcycle for a photo opportunity, his passport was temporarily seized by the Chinese government. He met, courted, and married Joanne Iris in 1985. They have three daughters, Mary and twins Anna and Regina. They continue to live in Scarborough, where Barry and Joanne tend a very productive one-acre garden. Needless to say, Barry will be missed by his many colleagues at Town Hall. What do you know about this Barry Tibbetts character? Well, um, I believe he worked here. Um, I, there's been a lot of hubbub about him leaving, but I wasn't, you didn't really see him much. So um, it's, I guess if he's off into the sunset, that's fantastic, good for him. Barry, thank you for everything you left me. Bye, Barry. Me and Barry go way back. Yeah? Yeah. How long? I'd say, you know, a year. So, I'm so not sure if Barry even knows who I am. Really? Good boy, boy. I've never met him. Barry who? Well, you know, you're Barry. Oh, Barry Jones, yeah. Barry. Be sure you return the book that's way overdue. You know, Management for Dummies. Barry Tibbetts. I bet he signed up for one of our senior trips. Barry, was that the guy that got arrested last night or was that was that Monday night? There we go, big wave. I'm sorry. You don't know him? Do you know Barry? I don't know what we're doing. You don't know Barry? No, I don't. I'm sorry. Bye, Barry, thank you. Uh, do you know Barry Tibbetts? No. <laughs> there goes the gray ghost. Oh, no. <laughs> Hey, do you have time to say something about Barry? No, I don't. I'm sorry. I don't even really remember him. It's been around a while. And the new guy, you know, I was trying to get my hours back into the, the, uh, the bright apartment, so maybe this afternoon I can get back up there and start the agenda. And don't worry about your browser history because all well, your secrets are safe with me. And into Perfecto is the usual walk of the three wise men, or as many of the staff says, the three musketeers are off to get coffee. So what does our friend usually get here? Small Americano, one sugar, one cream. Yes, thank you very much. Oh, that was great. Let's get back to work. As always, here we go. Barry. 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 Guy stays here all day long, every day. Come on, let's go. we got work to do. Uh, he's wanted us in a, in a Toyota Prius before. I don't know if you've seen some of our officers, but we, we 
we couldn't fit in a Toyota Prius, but I think we did finally. We found something that will work for us. It's good on gas. But seriously, we will all miss our dear friend, Barry Tibbetts. Barry, hey, it's great to uh, to know that we're going to pay you tribute tonight, June 21st, 2017. Uh, I personally want to say thank you for all you did uh, for the community over 19 years as manager, 24 years of total service. And I say that not only as the, the guy lucky enough to come in behind you, but for a longtime resident. Thanks so much for all you've done for Kenny Bunk. Bye, Barry. Bye. Bye, Barry. Bye, Barry. Bye, Barry. <laughs> say bye-bye. Hey Barry, it's been great working with you all these years. Thanks for hiring me and good luck with your new projects because I know you have gas. Bye, good luck. Bye. Good luck. Bye, Barry. Bye, Barry. It's been a great 24 years. Bye, Barry. Uh, good luck to you even though you don't need it because whatever you're going to do, it'll be fabulous. Barry, thank you very much. You did phenomenal, wonderful things for this town. Look at it, it's beautiful. Lower Village was nothing until you got here. It's amazing right now. So thank you very much for all you've done. Bye, Barry. We'll miss your warm smile and your uh, great forward-thinking attitude. Barry, we wish you the best. I don't know anybody that has been part of this town that has been more committed to its improvement, to, to making its citizens happy, and to doing things that were going to move us forward into the future. The town will never forget you. You may be gone, but you will never be forgotten. Uh, I'd like to thank Barry for all the help that he's uh, personally provided to me in my professional role, and also for the support for the fire department as a total. So good luck, thank you, and uh, if, if you ever have a fire at home and Scarborough doesn't take care of it for you, call us and we'll come down and help you out. Barry, good luck in the future. It was a pleasure knowing you while I was here in Kennebunk. Hey Barry, wish you all the best in your retirement and in your new chapter of your life. You have always supported the library and on behalf of the staff and the board and the entire community of Kennebunk, thank you. I was looking for something witty to say, so I turned to Google for something inspiring. I found a lovely quote by Mr. Rogers, so I'm going to read, often when you think you're at the end of something, you're at the beginning of something else. Best of luck, Barry. Thanks for everything. Cannibal Fire Rescue, dispatching Barry Tibbetts to retirement, effective June 30th, 2017. You're retired. <laughs> Bye, Barry. Bye, Barry. Bye, Barry. Bye, Barry. Bye, Barry. Bye, Barry.